what's going on. This is Legend Number All About the Kicks. Subscribe to that channel, put a like on that button. We want to talk about 106 in Park. If y'all remember that show, it started in 2000, ended in 2013 or 12. I went to the show a couple of times. I had so much fun there. Now, Roxy and Terrence, why they split up? Why did they split apart? It was like the AJ and Free thing. Um, Terrence and Roxy were smashing each other. You know, Terrence got his feelings. Roxy didn't want nothing else to do with him. <laughs> and Terrence got his feelings. Remember when Terrence crashed his car in LA, totaled it, and walked away? Remember that? I'm not saying that has something to do with Roxy, but Roxy's a pretty girl. But Roxy been around the war. She smashed a lot of dudes. You know what I mean? And Terrence got his feelings. You know, Terrence one of them dudes. He a good dude, but he's soft too. You know, he's soft. Not as soft like, you know, he, he's one of them dudes, emotional and all that type of stuff. You know, the, the kitty cat must have been real good for him to be acting like that. You know what I'm saying? You never let uh, business come before pressure or pressure come before business. You always keep your money, keep the money first. Females come and go. You know what I'm saying? That's easy to grab a female. You got money and a car and a nice house, you can bag any chick you want. It's no problem. Anyway, Terrence is doing good. He's making movies, he's he producing, he's on shows. Roxy, I think she's still on the radio station, so it's still made out for both of them. They still making money, they ain't poor. But you know, yeah, they were smashing back in the day, man. Terrence, I guess he was in love with her, man. You know, Roxy, you know, she cut him off. But you know how that goes, man. Next topic, let's go. Shiesty. Remember he shot the person in the club? That's what he in jail for right now. Um, he got to pay the victim $156,000 in damages. Um, so, got to pay them money. Got to pay that money. You know what I'm saying? The guy could have died. 150 some thousand ain't enough. But um, that's what, you know, they settled for. $156,000. Uh, Pooh Shicey should be getting out of some jail pretty soon, maybe another year, two years, maybe three. Um, he's definitely gonna be getting out real soon, but yeah, you gotta pay the victims, man. That's how it goes, man. You see what they did to R. Kelly, we have seventy thousand dollars in his paper, they took all his money and gave it to the victims. Um, it just is what it is, man. You do the, you do the crime, you gotta pay the time, and if you do, if you pay the time, you might have to pay some money. It's the way the game is, man. You, know, you gotta be careful what you out here doing in the streets, man. Because everybody ready to sue. They sue you, man. They don't care. You know, so it is what it is. Pusaishi should have known the shooting in the club. That was a stupid thing to do. But it is what it is. He learned his lesson. Maybe he get out. Maybe he'd be, he'd be a changed man. Next topic. Let's go. Now, T.I., you know. T.I., you know how T.I. is. That's my man. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta understand, T.I., you admit a snitch in any of you was playing around. You said you snitched on your cousin and Boosie stand by where well, he stand by. You know what I'm saying? T.I. always using big words to make us look like he, like we stupid. And the guy, don't get me wrong, he's talented. Back in 2003, I told people, this guy right here is going to be a legend in the game. People laughed at me. When it came down to 2006, when the King album came out, people didn't have nothing to say to me. They was like, you was right. T.I. is a smart dude. He, 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 you know, God bless him to have a good brain. You know what I'm saying? He's smart as hell. He used big words like he go to college and shit. You know I'm mean? hey, we respect that. But you admit to snitch on your cousin. You should have just kept your mouth shut and let people think what they wanted to think. You know what I'm saying? I know you said you and Boosie gonna work this behind the scenes. I know you have been friends for a long time. But you should have just kept your mouth shut. That's the best thing to do is keep your mouth shut. You don't need to go on social media and tell people you did this. Oh, you did that, you did that. You know what I'm saying? You had some fake paperwork done. You could have just got a lawyer to write that down for two or three thousand dollars and 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 send that paperwork in and said this and that. It could happen. It happens all the time. People just print stuff out and lie on you. You know what I'm saying? It's just the way the game is. But anyway, T.I., get your shit together, man. Stop out here on these social media platforms lying on yourself, making yourself look stupid. Because it's just making you look bad. You know what I'm saying? It just is what it is. You know what I'm saying? We know you a street dude. We know you sold drugs. We know you been to jail. You did everything that everybody in the world would love to go. You traveled the whole world. You been in every country. You did everything. You smashed all the pretty girls. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is, man. But you need to just chill out, be quiet, and don't stay off these platforms and just make music and go behind the scenes and produce all these artists you got. 
But subscribe to the channel, put a like on the button. If you think Boosie is tripping, leave a comment. If you think T.I. need to chill the hell out, leave a comment. We out of here. One love. Peace.